Raven is like one of the only league players that like doesn't super tilt when playing league. Uh, <gasps> Where's Zed? Oh, there he is! I should have left! You know what? I'm ready to be serious. I don't know about you guys. You know what I'm- I don't know about you guys, but I'm like ready to be serious, okay? I'm done playing around. I'm done being nice. I'm done being generous. I'm done giving them the lead. I'm done letting them win. I'm done letting them push lanes. I'm done letting them have towers. I'm done letting them have, you know, shit. So after I win this one, uh, if I win this one, B, don't tempt me. Don't tempt me. I I, I want to taste that plat. I want to taste that plat four. I want to taste it. Just a little lick. Uh, just a little one. Just a little one. That should be a kill. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Yes. Yes. Oh, that felt so good. Oh, y'all don't understand. I don't care if I lose now. <laughs> I don't care if I lose. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. That felt so good. You guys don't understand when you're getting harassed like that the whole game. And then you get a clean hit on them. Woo! I can when you squirt. Wins. Oh, my God. <coughs> Whoa. Sorry. 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 I need I think I need glasses. Oh my god. Why is this part darker? It's like I peed myself. But like up it's like I peed up there. Okay, well, I done goofed. Hold on. You guys see that? Look, I'm not mad. Oh, it's the shadow. It's a shadow. Oh my god, it's a shadow. It's a shadow. I didn't know it was a shadow! Oh my god. <laughs> Why am I so embarrassing? I didn't know it was a shadow! <laughs> it wasn't moving! It wasn't moving! Y'all. Y'all, I need to tell you something. Uh. Excuse me, not that. What I need to tell you... <laughs> I feel like I've fallen down so many times that I'm a pro at getting back up. I am getting close, but like, I just keep sucking so much. Your flow lies elsewhere. <laughs> I mean, if we're talking about a different kind of use for the belt. <laughs> that's different. But that's not what you're talking about, so. I don't plenty of spitting in my day, if you know what I mean. I'm great. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Erect. <laughs> what I've heard a lot of people say is that if you're going to take a nude, then you almost like deserve to be, for it to be exploited or sent around by others. And I think that's a really unfair of way of looking at them because it's not like they were meant for everybody they were meant for a specific person and just because their phone got hacked or something it doesn't mean it's like a to i told you so moment it should be i think people just need to have more damn empathy i like to make it very clear that it's just a hangout so that the intentions are clear, at least from my end. All you can do is be honest. All you can do is be clear and hope that the other party understands. Honestly, one thing I have learned over the years is if someone is in a negative situation and they are not pulling themselves out, you need to let them ride it out. Honestly, when we come to our own realization and we get severely burned, that's the only time we'll actually listen. Otherwise, if we only leave a certain situation because someone else told us to, we'll always be wondering like, what if? I'll share something with you guys. My most recent 
serious relationship after we ended things everyone and this is also by the way this is the worst advice that you can give someone guys if you have friends that are going through a breakup or they have made a very drastic big decision in their life just be kind to them and be supportive don't give them advice unless they ask for it and if you're going to give them advice when they've gotten out of a relationship please please i'm like i'm pleading with you guys don't be those people who say man it's okay man you'll get over him you'll get over her just go meet someone else so many people were telling me that so many people were saying you're so amazing you'll find someone better you're so this you'll find someone better you're so this you'll find someone better and it's like clearly you're not understanding what my heart is going through because if you really did understand then you would not be saying these hurtful things because you think you're helping me but you're hurting me you know and everyone kept saying like you need to let her go uh, sorry you need to let him go let him go let him go let him go i'm this is two and a half years later and i'm still figuring out a way to completely let him go you see what i mean so all of those people who were advising me and saying all these things and trying to pull me out of situations trying to push guys towards me that i should be um to be sleeping with instead or dating instead they if anything they just hurt me i needed to heal by myself at my own time at my own pace and there is no shame in healing at your own pace and i think people need to realize that we're human we had a connection with someone and as social beings as social creatures when we truly commit to someone and give them everything to let that go is very difficult so i needed to fall and get burned and keep messaging him and get burned and message him and get burned and message him and get burned i had to do that to heal the best thing that you can do for her is be there for her and you might think like i'm not doing anything i'm not able to provide for her i'm not able to help her i'm not able to do anything for her but you being there for her as a friend and like double d said always 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 being there for her when she needs you is the best thing that for her if someone isn't your friend anymore after you friend zone them that means their intentions were never oh my you the real mvp x you the real mvp i 1000 percent agree 1000 percent agree their main reason for having you in their life is not what they're leading you to believe it is that's my issue. That's my issue. Oh! There was a kid. Did you guys see that? There was a kid. There must be somebody there. Oh, hell no! What the hell is that? Ah! Oh my god. What was that? Oh, was the map. What happened? No! Stop! What's happening? I have to reach the master bedroom. How about... Don't. How about that? Jesus, Mary and Joseph. My mind is playing tricks on me. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. My mind is playing tricks on me! <coughs> I think I nailed that accent, by the way. Can I have some help, please? Running out the door She's running out She run, 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 run. 
what I was saying is thank you guys so much for being here. I know it's quite late wherever you guys are in the world and you're still here, so I really appreciate you guys. Thank you very much.